Now what I'm doing, what I'm doing is not unique to myself. What I'm doing is what the Bible commands every Christian to do. The Bible commands every Christian to preach the gospel. You can tell someone about what Christ did. You can tell one person or you can tell a group of people. doesn't matter. The Bible commands all of us to spread the gospel. The Bible commands all of us to preach the gospel. If anybody here claims to be a Christian and you have never told anyone the gospel, it has been months, it has been weeks, it has been days, and you have not warned anyone about the wrath of God, the one of two things, one of two reasons, reason one, you're being a disobedient Christian, or reason two, you're not a Christian, one of these possibilities, one of these. If you claim to be a believer, if you claim to follow Christ, and you never share the gospel with anyone, you're being a disobedient Christian, or you are not a Christian. I hope that you share the gospel. Because this is the reality, everyone. This is the reality. The Bible says in John chapter 3, verse 36, He who believes in the Son has eternal life. But he who does not obey the Son will not see life. But the wrath of God abides, abides on him. I'm talking to those of you who claim to be Christians. The Bible says that the wrath of God abides on those who do not believe. Why don't you tell someone the gospel? That they may believe and escape the wrath of God. And for those of you who are not Christians, when are you going to repent? When are you going to turn from your sin? When are you going to believe in Christ? When are you going to trust in Christ? For you to receive eternal life and salvation. When are you going to do it? Because tomorrow is not promised to anyone. Tomorrow is not promised to anyone down here. God bless you. You could die right now. A car could lose control right now. And splatter one of you on the pavement. 